Are we live? We're live. I guess we're live. It's Freddy's Nest Podcast, Episode 1. I'm Mason Shafronik. I'm Jackson Gibbs. We're here. We've been talking about this for three, three years. Three years? Yeah. Three years. We were doing news updates and it wasn't our thing, so we decided let's switch it up, do something a little more relaxed. I like this one. That better. makes us the news anchors, though. News anchors. We're here. What's the news going? News going? You know, just got off a week of three senior nights. Uh, love our seniors. You know, we're two seniors. Two seniors. You know, we just love our seniors. Best class out here. Oh, yeah. As a freshman, though, like, you think seniors are, like, these crazy things. You, like, look up to them, but, like, we're not. Really I, I guess we're looking down on the freshmen now. I guess so. But like A little bit. I'm 16. I mean, they're all short. It's crazy how short freshmen are now. Yep. They don't make I can't believe this is how we're starting this, but <laughs> anyways, we had the the drama. Drama put on a hell of a play. How was that play? Come in here. Come here. In yeah, how was the play? Oh. Wait, come here, Alex. I guess she's coming to the shot, but like How was the play you believe? This. Um, the, the, the natural average zombie apocalypse play was like really good. Our theater department, um, they're putting on clue this winter and that one's going to be really good. The you, play. This. Do you have a date for that one? Oh, I don't actually. I'm not keeping up with that. Oh, bye. Thanks, Allie. How many booms? I did guess I, that's our first guess. How many booms did I get? You think? Two booms. Out of 10? Oh, out of 10? Eight booms. Eight booms. Eight booms. Eight booms. Well, I first good show of the year. And then we got a little hint at the winter show. Winter show. Hey, early access over here. Yeah. A little unreleased. All right. Let's move on. Sports. Sports. A lot of sports around. I love sports around here. Love being from Frederick. You know. I feel like our athletics are actually pretty good. Yeah. Number one. Number one in uh, football for league. Yeah. You know, started off 0-2, like. but started off from the bottom. They did. that. Like that start, 0-2. Hate You're to see questioning, it. Hate uh, to see. but last year we started zero and three, made it to the playoffs. So exactly, I just knew. But, you know, just dealing with injuries, but everybody. I, I know we had so many weird injuries this year. First game, Tavin's out with a uh, sh- uh, elbow. Or I shoulder? think it was elbow. I've, I was in a, a weightlifting class with him. And he's got this funky brace on his arm. He wasn't doing nothing. Was like <laughs> the week after, he's doing squats, and the boys are holding the bar on his back. <laughs> It was wicked. Hey, no days off. No, he had to get his work in somehow. You know, just hoping for Frederick to have a uh, long playoff run. Yeah. Going into the playoffs, you know. I mean, our quarterback's freaking unreal, dude. What's his name? Gavin? Gavin Ishmael? Ishmael? Call him Ishmael? Or should I say call me Ishmael? You don't know. I, I, I'm i not picking up if the reference. If you know, you know. Okay, let's... If you know, <laughs> if you know, you know. Book. It's called Moby Dick. Put the put put the camera on him. Why are we putting the camera on him? Why, 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 yeah. All right. Should we look at some some stats for football? Let's hear. It. Let's hear. It. You know, the top rusher for the football team is actually Gavin Ishmael. Average, not surprised. Averaging forty yards a game. Did you tell him he needs to stop running? I did tell him because like he's not Lamar Jackson. He needs to stop being injured. We need him. But he is. I mean, he had that the like quad injury. It's because he was running. Yeah, he's got to sit in the pocket and throw the ball. You're a quarterback. Throw the ball. <laughs> no, but he does look pretty good when he runs. <laughs> <laughs> All right, y'all are weird. Okay, bunch of weirdos in the crowd. By the way, we do have a live audience. Um, our class is here. By the way, GBN is an actual class. Um, Come to open the house. Yeah. Say what's up. I guess. Um, if you want a signature to say so. Yeah. We actually get an elective credit for this, which is nice. Practical arts. Practical arts. This is an art. Whoa. We're which moving camera up do I look at? Not after this, it's not gonna be. <laughs> <laughs> this this show right here is an art. This is. We're making art right now. Gavin Gavin was twenty three touchdowns on the season so far. That's not bad. That's like Heisman numbers. That is. I was looking at his stats earlier. I think he's like fourth in the state or something. Twenty for passing yards yeah, and got, total yards. He's got twenty three passing, nine rushing. Ishmael's going to go shotgun. He's all alone. Motion man, Del Pitts. Fakes the handoff. Has Palma on the slant. That's caught. Palma breaks it to the outside. Palma down the right sideline. Looking for the pylon. Cuts back in. Touchdown, Jizro Palma. A few scratch marks up on the board. It's absolutely nothing. Just snap. Del Pitts makes the grab on the screen. Del Pitts down the left sideline. Sonny Del Pitts in a foot race. 40, 30, 20, 10. 
five, touchdown, Sonny Del Pitts. Watch out for Del Pitts. Ishmael's gonna go shotgun, trips left. Salazar's back there with him. Palma's all alone. Here's Ishmael looking for the end zone. That's big run. Caught, touchdown, once again. Burks, Burks leading with nine, uh, nine touchdowns. I feel like that chemistry between Burke and Burke and Gavin is like unmatched. Well, it's yeah. like two brothers almost. They've been playing together for a long time. For a long time. I mean, back to that, that weightlifting class, they're just together. Yeah. It's like two peas in a pod. Can't, can't break them up. <laughs> <laughs> Let's move on. Let's move on. Softball? Softball. You they know, were pretty nice. Pretty good. You know, Peyton had that career high 15 Ks. 15? 2-2. Two, two, don't want to make this full count. And that will not be full goes. count. 15 on the day for Torres. Not the only senior that's out there cooking. You know, batting average is Avery with a .45. Is that good? I don't know baseball. That's pretty good. I know you're a big hockey guy. I am. I am. But I used to play ball. .45 is not bad. Again, with Avery with a .5 on base percentage. Also not bad. Not bad. Not bad. A lot of stolen bases from Ella. She's a thief. I feel like in softball, stealing a base is like, I mean, it's different because they got to stay on the bag after, like during the pitch. They do. But also the bases are way shorter. They do. I don't know. I just play softball and PE. That's a fun clap. Playing game on, yeah. playing softball and game on. Hit dingers. It's pretty nice. A little 9 a.m. going out and swinging the, swinging the stick. Swinging that stick at 9 a.m. <laughs> Uh, tennis? Tennis. Tennis? Tennis. We had Josiah Britton. If you watch our Instagram, you'll see the preview of that. We had Josiah in here, and he was, he's the, the varsity number one guy. Yep. Top he, dog. Top dog. He went eight and one in singles. I love that guy. Not bad. Not bad. Not bad. Not good enough, though. Not good enough. He actually, his signature's right here. That's cool. Um... How else did the tennis team do? You actually played tennis. I played tennis, actually, yeah. Did you? Did I. How good were you? Uh, better than Josiah. Oh. You know, but... Shots fired. Joe? Hey, Joe, can we attest to that? Not true? Um, so one of you's lying here. Hey, who's running the podcast? That's true. Clearly our, our guest here... You're not a guest. Co-host. Come on. Co-host is the winner. Um, I'm the Bizzo King. <laughs> Got the what? Bizzo King. Bizzo King. Basically, I'm unfamiliar with the term. So you say on net, right? You spike the ball. It hits the court and it goes over the fence. You're like over the fence. Over the fence. Do you want to do that? Yeah. So they oh. can't return the ball if it goes over the fence. Okay. And it makes you look cool. Yeah. And so you got 15 balls in the road, and coach is wondering what's happening. I'm just destroying them. What? Okay. Okay. Um. All right, we'll 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 move past that. Uh, volleyball? Volleyball. Eight sweeps on the season? Nasty. That's pretty good. Didn't know we had so many brooms out there. Broom season. Kyla with the serve, trying to close it. Serve from Kyla. Well struck, let low. Tatiana, Maya, quickly sent over, trying to win it. Will they do it? They do! Maya Negretti won the first set, wins the third. Frederick will complete the sweep. I feel like over the, like, the time of this podcast, we're going to say broom season a lot. We win a lot. We win, yeah. Welcome to Back Frederick. Again, I Welcome think our, Frederick. our sports teams are pretty good. Welcome to Frederick, guys. I, I heard someone like the other day was like, I've never heard of Frederick until you come in our building and we blow you out. Yeah. Whoa. All right, all right. <laughs> exactly. We're just good at sports. We're, we're good at a lot of sports. Yeah, and our academics. And broadcasting. Yeah, facts. We're there. Hey, you know what? We're doing it. So our brad broadcasting is pretty legit. State champs, by the way, year one. <laughs> we don't talk about last year, though. We got cheated. We, what the heck? That was sung by Jake Marson. <laughs> Stick to teaching. 
producer of this show. Okay. All right. Disney adult? Let's talk about our winter season because fall season's almost over. Our winter season's coming. I'm ready for basketball. Basketball's going to be nice. Basketball. They're going to be filthy this year. Filthy. That court's going to be dirty. Heck of dirty. Heck of dirty? Can't cuss on this one. <laughs> Whoa. Yeah. You gotta get, it's more the mops, you know, like on the court. Got to get the mops going. You know, hey, first ever, first ever GBN, swim. We will be doing swim. Hey, check it on that be one. Be tuned for, tuned in for swim. We like swimming and stuff, yeah. Yeah. Some aquatic action. What was that, Marzi? We're, we're playing basketball. That's going to be most of our streams, probably 55% of our streams are going to be basketball. We're going to be, we're going to show you some good action. Speaking of basketball. We have a baller in our classroom. Baller. 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 25 on the court. Her name is Zoe Whitler. Welcome, Zoe Whitler, to the show. Are we doing the signing right now? We're doing the signing right now. You got to right sign. Now. Right now. Mandatory sign. Please be better than Josiah's. Because last time Josiah signed and it was not it. <laughs> with uh, the number with the two? 25, I told you 25. 25 in the, on the court, number one in our hearts. <laughs> exactly. All right. Welcome to the show. Thanks for having me. We're excited. We're, yeah. What's you up, know? Jackson? Nothing much. <laughs> <laughs> All right. First question. Are you prepared for this season? I'm beyond prepared. How much? So prepared. All right, to the point that I'm ready for preseason to be over. I'm just ready for season. Whoa. How are you doing preseason? 4-0. Oh. How much are you averaging? averaging? Like 20. 20. Actually, I don't know. <laughs> that's it, Austin? You said that's it and you s average five points? <laughs> <laughs> that boy sits on the bench. Whoa. On JV. Oh. Doesn't even start in JV. Okay. What is your favorite memory, tournament memory? Mm, That's a difficult question. Probably sophomore year, uh -huh. Sweet Sixteen. Uh -huh. Or no, this is this is uh -huh. this is to go to Sweet Sixteen, and we're playing at Palmer Ridge. Uh -huh. We're supposed to be blown out. Mm -hmm. And we come and we put an upset in their home. Ooh. That was, I that's, that was that's gotta be electric. Yeah, yeah. And their whole gym's just like silent, you know, because they're supposed to have blown us yeah. out. But we had like, we had a full on huge rowdy crowd, which is our parents. They're like chanting <laughs> for us. We're all hype. We pull an upset and win. That was probably my highlight. Hey, right. I feel like the encore action is better like when the crowd's going. Yes. yes. Like if it's dead silent, like back in COVID, like even watching pro sports, it was like, it's just, it's just not guys fun. going. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just squeaking. <laughs> yeah. Hate the squeaks. Just squeaks on the court. <laughs> but when the crowd's into it, it's electric. Yeah. The players like get so much energy from the crowd. And then it also just makes it more entertaining to watch. Oh, yeah. For yeah. sure. Especially home playoff games for basketball. You, when the games like really matter, yeah. you got to lock it. When it's it. close it's and like, everybody's yeah. loud. <sighs> Hitting game winners. Oh. um, So... You were homecoming queen this year. How's that feel? Um, it was very honoring. It was just very special um, to be nominated in the first place. And um, Maggie and Ava were up there with me, and, and either one of them would have been a phenomenal queen. But um, to get it was just very, very um, honoring. I was, yeah, very it was humble. pretty cool. I feel like you do a lot around here. I do do a lot. I mean. What else do you do? Name everything you do around here. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I am. I run FCA. I'm in NHS. I do theater and choir, broadcasting, basketball. Running I volunteer at our church. I'm on our um, youth group leadership team. How do you have time? That for might this? be it. Eight. Uh, you just kind of pick and choose which ones you have to go to that week. Mm, you know, I like for it, example, yeah. like last night I was supposed to be like at our youth group because I'm on the leadership team, but I had games. So I decided to let them know, like, hey, I'm not going to be there. Yeah. So you kind of just have to work it out. Uh -huh. And then there's also some things you have to know, like, how involved can can you be in it. And, and you're not telling them that you're also 4.0 plus. I do have a 4.0. An academic <laughs> weapon, too? Yes. <laughs> Done. Uh, I have close to a 4.2. It's like a 4.16 or something. On great. Aren't you going to college somewhere? Yeah, I just committed. I heard that you're committed. A little commit? Committed. Are you committed? <laughs> Yep. 
<laughs> Where? Yeah, I'm going yeah. to Southwestern Oklahoma State. It's a D2 in Weatherford, Oklahoma. No, it's got it's a not ni- bad. It's got a nice basketball court. It Is does. It? It's got like a full-on stadium. Can we put it's actually pretty Can sweet. You trying to put a picture up? We can throw a picture in. Throw. Can we get you sh- let's get her commitment picture up there. <laughs> <laughs> How was your? Third. Did you visit? I did. I visited twice. How yeah. was it? It was good. Um, the first time I visited, it was like, um, like right when school had started for them. So it was kind of like, in, like all of them were still getting used to it. But yeah. it was nice. The coaches are um, super sweet. Uh, but also having a good balance of like, you know, they're gonna push you in practice, but they're not gonna like ruin your confidence if yeah. that makes yeah, yeah. sense. Like so it's like a good you. balance. Mm. And then I was able to talk with like some of like a lot of the girls, um, kind of get their opinions and. And that was nice, not only just to talk to them, but also, like, they don't have any bias. So you can just be like, How, what are your true yeah. feelings? And all of them were like, oh, this is really cool. They like so. it. That's good. Yeah. It's always good when the players like it. Yeah, yeah. And it says a lot of the program. Like, even the freshmen. I mean, you know, they've only been there a couple of weeks now, but even they were just saying, like, their first, um, like, impressions. Like, yeah. they were giving it to you, and all of them were, were really good. Positive. What are you majoring in? Um, I'm thinking psychology. Whoa. Mm. Yeah. Whoa. Some smart stuff. Why is he shaking his head? <laughs> well, hey, why? What? We don't know. Okay, GBN is selling butter braids. What's your mascot? How are, are, <laughs> how are you doing on your butter braid sales? Um, what is your mascot for your college? My mascot for college is the Bulldogs. Mm, are the jerseys tough? They're not bad. Not bad. Like better or worse than ours? Mm. I don't think she should have to answer that. Depends. Dep- Depends. They're just like very different. Like our jerseys are like really tight. Mm-hmm. At least mine are. <laughs> and there's like a good fit, but I like both colors, so they're yeah, that's good. How's your butter braid sales going? <laughs> uh, to be honest, not very good. I'm waiting to do the music foundation one because we're going to Disney in the spring. We're competing there. Yeah, we don't have enough money yeah, for that one. Yeah, so I'm waiting to do butter braids f- for them. So Se- I have not even started Disney? broadcasting. <laughs> senior GBN needs a Disney trip. Senior trip. Senior trip. Marzi. I'm not a Disney adult. He is. Yes, he, was. he is a Disney Very adult. Very much a Disney adult. He is, though. Why do you all say that? Because you go farming. around just do in the Mickey can we, can voice. Can we show that's, the that's Mickey Disney here, adult. too? <laughs> He's got a Mickey? Disney reference. You can't do that or they'll copyright strike us. We're just <laughs> shouting out Disney. Yeah. Yeah. Didn't, they lose out. Right, didn't they lose yeah. the right to Mickey Mouse? <laughs> no. No, they didn't lose the right. Just, just Steamboat Willie. Just the original Mickey. Yeah. Uh, that's Steamboat Willie. I don't know what his name was. <laughs> So I had to see more Willie. Well, yeah. Anyways, back back to our action here. Do you have any other plans? What are your plans after college? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> That's I don't four know years, bro. Yeah. I, That's four, geez, years, four years. So a lot of things like happen in four years. Bingo. <laughs> I, like, I don't know. What yeah. are you looking at me like yeah. that for? I don't know. You gave me a weird look. Do you know I what you're going to do after college or whatever in four he years? He's going to college. Really. He's going to yeah. McDonald's gonna University. McDonald's University? Exactly. Four I've ride? heard uh, Wendy's got that Krabby Patty meal going. I might I might have to invest in that. I'm, hey, you know where I'm going for college? Old Moo. Old Moo. Oh, Old yes. Moo. Old Moo. Old Moo. Better than Pig State, guys. Better than Pig exactly. State. Exactly. <laughs> hey. The, M- the MCAA. M- hey, that, that was I'm fake. That's right insurance, that. insurance fraud from... Pick exactly. State Have you heard fraud. of the MCAA? Maybe. Tell it's me on about TikTok. It's this Minecraft college football. Football, yeah. And it's <clears> these <throat> like made up teams, but they compete. And there's huge stadiums. And there's huge fights. Oh my goodness. You should have seen the fight between Villager Tech and Pillager Tech. Or is it Villager Tech? Ho- I, I don't know. Like the people fight like in the stadiums? Yeah, like, the, it's like uh or like in the game. The Minecraft characters. The Minecraft like Villagers like fight in the tunnel. <laughs> you ever out. you ever hear you ever see the Michigan Michigan State fight? It's just like that. It's oh. wicked. You hate to People see people go it. crazy for this. Live or die. <laughs> old, old Moo. Wait, which camera do I look at? Old Moo is the best college. At, um, ma- exactly. Old Moo, ride or die. Old Moo is going to win it this year. Pig State stinks. Pig State is takes. You got their takes. 
We're we're off track once again. What are we? Get this back happens on the, a lot. Get back on the tracks. Okay. <laughs> well, Zoe, we thank you for coming to episode one. Thanks for having me. You're yeah. a way better. You're a way better guest than the first one. Yeah, our first one. Thanks. He stole from Freddy's, which was interesting. But That's have what you I ever heard. stolen I, in your I life? Saw that. I heard that. Have you ever stolen in your life? No. No theft. He's, no theft. He steals all the time. Yeah, Joe's. <laughs> what a theft. Yeah, <laughs> we're off topic once again. What even is our topic right now? We, yeah, nothing. Zoe should be our topic. Oh, so you just got back from Kenya. How was that? Oh, facts. I did. You, you went to a whole different continent. Yeah, I was in Kenya for nine days. Was it fun? It was Seas? really cool. Yeah, yeah. It's crazy, like the living conditions they're in. But the kids are always just like so joyful all the time that like instead of feeling sad, you just feel so happy because they're like smiling, truly just so excited to like see you and just for you to be there. Like no matter what you're doing, you're going to make their day just because you're there. And so that was like really cool to see. That's cool. You know, just out here making an impact in the world. <laughs> Zoe is making an impact in the world. President, Zoe for president, 20 what? 80? 2080. 2080, <laughs> Zoe for president. Don't you think it'll be 40 to be president? 2080? Hold on. Let me do math. Zoe's going to change that. We're going to make Zoe, like, at 25, she's president. First woman president at 25? You got to be powerful. And I'd be Zoe's 74. <laughs> <laughs> oh, crap. Not 2080. I guess we'll never know. Check in at 2080. Yeah. It's like a time capsule. Be here. All right. Zoe, we thank you for being on our show. Of course. Episode one. Episode one. I think that's wraps. Good luck this Thank you. Facts. Good luck. Yep, yep, Good yep. Luck. Hopefully no injuries. <laughs> well, thank you guys for watching the Freddy's Nest, episode one complete. Way more to come. Oh, yeah. We'll, we'll find more things to talk about. I'm Mason Shafronik. I'm, I'm Jackson. Zoe Whitler. I'm Jackson oh, Gibbs. Jackson Gibbs. <laughs> Zoe Whitler. Yeah, you're the guest. I'm the co-host. Yes. Sorry, my bad. Thank you guys for watching. We're out. Birds are out. Birds. <laughs>